Hello everybody and welcome back to Farming Simulator with Gaming Goose. We're on part 7 and it is winter. There's something really special about winter on this game. The ambience. I always look forward to the winter even though there's not many jobs that you can complete. Can't really work on your fields much. Everything's um, snowed under. But I do have these pallets that I need to collect. I've got some pallets down at the other end of honey. I'm just going to be quiet for a moment and let you just enjoy the sweet ambience of this game. It really is beautiful. So today's little job is going to be, I'm going to get in the forklift, get everything picked up, store it away to keep it away from the cold. So let's get on with part 7 from the series. I think I'm going to have to do two at a time, try and get them in at two at a time because I want to store them in this little, um, this little shed that I've got. I am contemplating um, taking this shed down and building another one because it is quite small. I'm uh, a bit limited what I can put in it, as I'll show you in a minute. I was thinking about moving my car and trailer over, but it's too small to get my car in. As you can see there, the height of it, I can't get the forks under. Well, I don't think I can now, they're never going to go under, so I can't get the forks under either. So at the minute, it's storing a few seeds. I, mo I moved the bags of seeds round put them to the front and it was storing the seeds and the water container I've got rid of that now so I'm just going to try and get these stored up going to put the lettuce in there as well because I don't want the lettuce getting all frozen can damage the produce I do want this serves to be as realistic as possible so you're not just going to leave the produce out like this going to try and give it some cover from the weather although it is frozen fresh but yeah there's something about this game during winter that I love it started snowing yesterday I woke up this morning full blanket of snow and it's just so nice when you can hear the crunch of the snow and everything's a bit more slippery even driving the forklift when you go around a corner it skids but it's something about it that I just love. It just adds to the ambience. I'm so glad that um, they added it into the game and it didn't just skip these months because it is a bit limited what you can do. There's not many contracts. I've had a look. Um, there's not much field work that you can do because you can damage your crops in the winter if you've got it turned on. But it's ideal just to have a quick drive around, get all your things tidied up. You can feed your animals, which is good. I haven't got any livestock at the minute, but if you've got livestock, you can obviously feed them during winter and keep them all nice and warm and fed but until we get to that stage obviously we're still in the beginning of this series we're in his first year um, so there's not much you can do other than this but I have got some news as I go around to the I'll drop this here I've got some news which we will cover in a minute So the news is, I did buy a second field. I took a little loan out of £50,000. Look at that. It's like a post, like a Christmas card. Got birds flying around, snow, and a little deer just eating the frozen uh, crops. But yeah, I did buy a second field, which I'll go over fully in the next episode and show you. I've already tested it, we can get to around 94% yield, so that's good. It was only £30,000 for, uh, for the second field. So when we get to the next episode, things will really be moving forward, which I'm working on at the minute. I just want to show you what I did earlier, I was just moving these bags. As I say, there's not much you can do in winter, but I did want a, a wintry episode. Just having a look at the time, we're five minutes in. So I'm going to move these bags round. Put some nice, uh, just let you enjoy the sounds of the game. 
something a little bit different today, a shorter video, but just to show you what this game's like during winter. As we get everything wrapped up, as we say goodbye to the first year on the farm, and next year there'll be big things happening. We've got a second field, we're going to get some livestock, and we can finally sell the produce and harvest these crops. So I'll see you all on the next one and we'll just play the rest of this video out using the sounds of the game. <laughs>